a small selection of gas lamps uh, showing the whole development uh, in 19th century. You have uh, first uh, open flame burners, like this one. This is what we call the bat swing burner. Just like uh, a cigar lighter, you have just a jet of gas streaming out of a slit. And uh, what, uh, what period of time was this uh, used? From the very beginning, in the early 19th century, they already had invented flat flames for oil lighting. Okay. Before the turn of the century already. And uh, when you have a proven uh, technology and you have a new fuel coming on the market, you, you use the same knowledge to apply it to the new fuel. So gas burners, the very first gas burners were not just jets, but flat flames, because a flat flame receives enough oxygen for a good uh, mixture. And what uh, what kind of gas is this now? Natural no, gas? No. We are using natural gas. I can also use uh, propane for some specific burners. But this is natural gas. Even if the burner was designed for coal gas, uh, it seems to work quite properly. You can see this blue zone at the yeah, bottom. That's the that high. was not there originally. It was not. Because we don't have enough... Um, carbon in this new gas, in, the, in the natural gas, oh. so that yields a blue zone. Okay, now the oil that you're talking about, was that whale oil that they were using originally? Mainly vegetable oil in continental Europe because uh, mainly English-speaking countries hunted uh, whale. Okay. Not the yeah. French. They did use a little bit, but uh, you'll... Uh, it would have been rapeseed. Hardly find the... Most of them was rapeseed. Ra rapeseed. <laughs> rapeseed. Are, rapeseed. Still, are they still growing that? Sure are. Rapeseed. And you can still buy rapeseed. Rapeseed. Also, canola oil. Is canola, that's what we yeah. saw up in Normandy, yeah. right? Yeah. They, they grow exactly. it all over. Uh, okay.